thankful for my flaws. I'm thankful for my trials. Thankful for my pain. I'm thankful for my insecurities. I'm thankful for my mental challenges. I'm thankful for life. For breath. Thankful for family and friends. I'm thankful for God giving me the strength to just keep on pushing on every single moment of the day. I love me. I love me. I love myself. What do these words mean? And how much impact do they have on your life? Well, these words mean a lot. If you watch the other videos, we've already talked about how these waves, as you can see right behind me, they just, they go out into the atmosphere and they have an amazing effect on your life. And just to give a little breakdown again, there's no way these frequencies that I just recorded, that you just saw me record, there's no way that they don't do something. There's no way that they don't boomerang and have some type of impact on your reality and your reflection of purpose. If there's purpose and substance and passion behind your words, oh, they, they have a lot to do with your life and your reality. I once read how critical it is to say, I'm thankful for whatever I'm going through. In the darkness of everything that I was going through, when I felt like I was just staring demons in their face and couldn't control my thoughts and couldn't control, you know, my feelings, depression, suicide, anxiety, panic attacks, etc., etc. I had to rely on those, those frequencies. And I didn't know whether to believe it or not, but I'm like, I'm going to try. And I would. I would say, even if I didn't mean it, I would say it. I would say it so much to the point to where I was hoping that at some point it would connect and I would mean it. I would go in the mirror. I would wake up in the morning or I would be at the job I was at and I would go in the mirror and I would say, I love you to the mirror 10 times. Just, I was like, just say it. I love you, I love you, I love you, I love life, I love life, I love life. And it hurt like hell. Man, it hurt like hell, man. It's not easy. I'm not going to lie to you. It's not easy. And in my portrayal and expression of how God has delivered me and why I am where I am today at this moment, it's not to make you believe that things will change in your life overnight or in a matter of an instant. When I think of the word thankfulness, when I think of thank you, without looking at the definition of it, I think of the word full being attached to it. Like you just embrace it. You accept it. You know, you have your arms wide out and you're like, I'm in it and I'm going to fight it and I'm going to go through it and I'm going to be full of life and love and somehow, some way, by the end of this, there's going to be some gold or something at the end of the tunnel <laughs> on the other side. And it's true. I'm, I'm a living testimony. Like many others, I'm a living testimony of how life can be so painful and so weird, so supernatural and so damaging psychologically, mentally, emotionally, and spiritually. But I'm talking to you about something that I've been doing for over 17 years. And I never even realized that my words had an impact on my life. It had an impact on the beginning of my career and it still has an impact on me today. So, I say all these things to say that being thankful and being consistent about being thankful means the world. Again, these waves go out into the atmosphere, whether you're praying, whatever it is you're doing, like it goes somewhere and it does return. And it doesn't return void. Another way to look at this is this. This will be the last thing I say. It was the point in that moment when I decided to be submissive and relinquish all power. You may not be able to be thankful, 
But what I can say, spiritually speaking, again, these words, these frequencies, I always say the same thing. They don't have anything to do with religion, culture, or color. But when they go out into the air, like it doesn't, it doesn't see race. It doesn't see racial issues. It doesn't see politics and governments and 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 violence. It just sees whatever it reflects, where it's coming from. So you may not be strong enough, but spiritually speaking, you call on God. If you call on your angels, don't try to do it by yourself, because I didn't. No matter how many times I said I was thankful, I still needed help. That's what I'm thankful for. I'm thankful for understanding what having no control and no power really feels like and what it really means. It means that you're strong. Thankfulness to me means full of blessings. That's what thankfulness is to me. All right, that's going to do it for this segment of the New Wave Reality. Again, reiterating that New Wave Reality is a new way to communicate. Faith, that's what faith is. Faith is what's unseen. and I'm not, I'm not arguing that. But what I am saying is every time you speak, now you can see those are what your words look like coming out your mouth. It's time to communicate a different way, a new way with others, with family, with friends, with all those around us. So a new way to create and shape shift your reality. Happy Thanksgiving.